had to sort out all your stuff. Couldn't believe you had that much crap. Especially paper. Tons and tons of pieces of paper. I tried to arrange them all, you know. Put them in different stacks and files. But eventually I gave up. You had the test one month before you moved in and you were clean. Johnny! Johnny! You're not listening to me! He was your brother! You'll end up just like him! What do you want me to do? What do you want me to do? What do you want me to do? Forget him? They shot him like a fucking animal in the street. I owe everything to me. I miss him too! I owe him too! But you're better than this. You're better than him. It's funny how certain ideas seem great until the morning after. Now the question is, how do I prevent Jess from knowing that I proposed to a pregnant sister yesterday? Oh no. Morning. Morning. Did you sleep well? Better than half the years. Tell her you're not ready to see other people yet. Listen. Because we are seeing each other, aren't we? This is your chance. Be a man. Of course. Damn. Yeah, all okay. You'll be late for work if you don't get a move on. <sighs> for hell. <laughs> mm. When Jack told me that he and Anne had gotten engaged, I cried. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I couldn't think of two people who are better suited. Apart from me and Jack, of course. <laughs> I feel very, very lucky to have the two of you in my life. Jack, I admire you. Defending our country. And now bagging the best girl in town. Anne. You're amazing. Jack is a very lucky man. Very, very lucky. Women are weird. I'm past trying to figure them out. Best bet is to smile and nod and run a hot bath. But that's not. It'll pass, mate. You've just been away. You're back. She just needs time to adjust. Yeah. Thanks for listening, Tom. Appreciate it. Available for weddings, funerals, and permits. I need a piss.